Hello audience, my name is Cheshire Wolf and welcome to Carrion. So, you can kind of get an idea of what kind of game this is just from the title screen here. Uh, lots of tentacles. So, this game just came out today on the day that I'm playing it. Um, and it is described by the developers as a reverse horror game where you play as the monster that is killing scientists or soldiers or whatever. Um, I remember when this game was first announced, I saw it and I'm, I immediately bookmarked it because it looked so cool and I'm super excited to play it. Um, it takes very obvious inspiration from one of my favorite horror movies of all time, The Thing, which if you're into body horror and you haven't seen The Thing, what are you even doing with your life? Um, so we're, we're just, we're just gonna go in. I'm excited. I got the lights down because it's all spooky. Um, okay, so we're in some sort of facility here. And, oh, we're a little, we're a little creature. Let's see, I can't get through these, uh, these things here. So. Ooh, everyone's, everyone's all freaking out. So it's pretty simple mechanics, it just follows the mouse. Uh, I can't get through there. So it's kind of like a puzzle, kind of exploration-ish game, where I try to uh, find my way through each level and not get killed. So it can go underwater. That's good to know. Uh, I like the look of me. I'm, I don't know if I'm guessing I'll like mutate and or change. Okay, hold right mouse to grab objects move the mouse to interact with them so I can drag things out of the way okay like that that's fun I'm kind of like a weird little octopus dude um, but yeah the thing um, is one of the most um, influential body horror movies and one of the most influential horror movies and oh my god that's a dude oh man shredded that guy oh did I grow a little bigger I think I might have grown a little bigger. So, oh, I can open doors. Okay, this is this is really cool. I can I open this door. I'm very much liking this. I don't think I can open that door yet. Oh, but I can go up here. So I'm guessing I do add the body mass of whichever people I kill. Uh, and the thing, if it touches someone and absorbs them into it, and um, basically uses their flesh as its own. If I... Okay, I was wondering if that guy was going to come in here. Oh, there's a guy. Okay, so I just grow mouths, so... Okay, very cool. And... Can they see me up here? I don't know. I don't know. Let's wait for that person to go in there. And let's get those two. Oh my god, this is so satisfying. It's so it's so satisfying to just be the be the monster. That that is that is excellent. I am absolutely loving this. Let's see what's up here. I'm getting big too. Uh, I can't yet tear through that, so uh spacebar to squeeze in. Okay, what's in here? Can I pull the lever? Ah, and that makes the big blast doors open. Okay, I'm having fun. This is very cool. But yeah, it reminds me of like the old school games that you'd play in like Congregate and Newgrounds and stuff, and I'm a big fan of that feel. Can I break through this glass yet? No, I cannot. And you gotta love just a big fleshy tentacle beast. Like, it's great. Okay, let's go up here. Spread biomass and save. Oh, okay, so we're doing the whole like meat moss thing where we grow onto places. Ooh, that's fun. So we can infect places and kind of make them part of our weird hive mind. Oh, I can, oh, I can go down. No, that's where I came from. Okay, squeeze in here. It's alive, achievement unlocked. This is fun, this is fun. Um, oh, I'm breaking free, breaking out of the lab, okay. Let's see. Seals breach. Biomass samples lost 50%. What's over here? Okay, I can't get in there, I don't think, but can I go down here? Yes? No? Maybe so? I cannot break through that. Okay. I can't go in there yet, but I can go out here. 
this is just good fun. Like, I, it, it's not scary because you are the monster and that's kind of the point. And I'm thinking, I'm trying to figure out if I've seen this concept done before in a game, like a game where you are the monster. And I'm, I'm sure there are games, but I don't know if I've seen them, seen very many of them at least. And this one is just done really well. I'm a big fan. Just, you can't get up here. All right, let's, let's, uh, let's get into the mindset of this little, this little beastie here. So uh, we'll see what I can, see what creatures I can get, see what I can eat. Uh, I can't get through there. Okay, well, what do I do? What do I do? We need a name for this little dude. Oh, can I press? I can totally. Uh, yeah, now I can get through. We need a name for this little dude. Um, what would you name a little horrible abomination that feasts on the blood of the innocent and eats people? I think I would name it Bernard. So Bernard, what are we doing here? Can I fit through here? Ah, uh, I, I can, maybe? No, I cannot yet reach that far. Okay, so, oh wait, can I, no, okay, I can't go through there, can't go through, oh, I can, I can crumble that, okay, it's kind of unclear what is or is not, what is that, is that a rocking horse? Oh no, it's a piece of electrical equipment, oh, I can throw things really well, I wonder if I could kill someone by throwing them, alright, Bernard, let's go, oh, I can squeeze through in here, I have no idea how long this game is. Oh, I'm, I'm excreting my biomass through this area. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, saving. Military junkyard. I don't know how I got here. I, I don't know where I am. But I know that uh, I'm hunting people. I haven't seen people in a while either. Ooh, so the little... Oh, there's someone. Oh, they've got a gun. That's cute. That's cute. That's so cute. Oh, can I not? Okay, I can fit through this pipe here. And from here, I can store and... Yeah, get, get crunched. Oh, that's so fun. It's so fun. You just crunch people. They're like little Cheeto puffs. Oh man. Yep, spread biomass. This thing, oh my god, I just ri ripped open that whole area. That's awesome. Um, what, what was that that I saw? Shoot, anything that moves and does not appear human? So we can't transform into a person. So rather unlike the thing in that regard. Oh, you can throw people. That's awesome. Oh, that's so fun. Oh, that's fun. Uh, I can tear down a bunch of stuff from up here, but I don't know what the purpose is. Is this just a dead end here? I think it is. Nope, there's a pipe. Gotta it, look at the environment and see what's going on with everything. I just put a bunch of things in my way here. Can I go through? Yes, I can. Okay, I'm just excited. This is fun. This is fun. Oh my god, it's so fun. Oh, shit. So things can shoot me and I think that decreases my biomass, so I gotta be careful. So it's kind of like a stealth-based game, too, because you need to avoid... Oh, that person's still alive. Okay. So I, if I wanted to, I could probably leave some people alive. Oh, that, that's going up, so I can't go down in there. Um, let's see, is there anywhere else I can go here? Oh, yeah. Oh, they don't even know what's coming. Oh, that's so good. That's so fun. Oh, I love this. It's so fun. I'm so, I'm so excited. Oh, this is so my kind of game. Uh, part of my... Okay. Oh, three out, two out of the three. That's what it was showing me before. Okay. Save and retrieve biomass. How do I do that? What does that do? Oh. Does that make me bigger, I think? Maybe? Interesting. Interesting. Um, but part of my favorite part, pff, my favorite part about horror games is generally the monsters in them. That's my favorite part of horror movies too. So if you get to play as the monster, that's like uh, it's a win-win situation for me. That's, that's everything I could ever want. What am I doing here? Can I? Oh, I gotta. Okay, I'm breaking this. Uh, can I break it more? Yeah, that. 
that's what we're talking about. Wait, was there something I can do? Yeah, squeeze it. Oh, I can squeeze in there. Uh, new DNA, DNA absorbed. Arachnotypsis. Ar Arachnopsis. Shoot a cobweb to trap your victim or interact with objects. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's so cool. Do I have limited? I don't think I do. I think I have an infinite cobweb. That's... That's really cool. Oh, yeah. That's fun. So we get to gain more powers as we go. I just remembered a game that actually has a very similar concept to this, and that is The Visitor, which is, it was on, it's like a Flash game on, like, Congregate and Newgrounds. You know, I, I love those old games. Um, but you played as this little alien. This is back where I was. Okay, that's... Give me a second while I get back up there. Okay, so it was like a game where you played as this little alien that came down in a um, meteor and you go around eating people. Yeah, open that. Um, and as you eat different things, you absorb them and gain powers and obviously also inspired by the thing. Sneak down behind you. Uh, I was hoping to crush them. Oh, they they see me. They see me. Or they saw... Oh, and we're going. Yep. Oh, I like tossing them around almost as much as I like eating them. Yeah. Oh my god, that's so fun. That's so crunchy. Oh, shit. Do not. Okay, so yeah, if they shoot me, it does hurt me. I can't go down there. Let's see what little things we can do here. Uh, we can rip this open. Uh, this thing is fast, too. Oh, I like it. I like this creature. Uh, let's just break through and go up here. What's up here? Oh, it's a dead end. Oh, that's the place that I want to go that I'm slowly unlocking. Uh, up here... This game plays really smoothly. It's very fun. Uh, and... Come on. Oh, what? what's that? What's that? You you on guard? Oh, what was that? Did you hear something? Wanna check on it? Oh, dude, dude. Oh, I'm so sorry. Man, that must really suck. Just open a door and... Oh, there we go. Now I'll... Oh no, that just opens that door. So I have not unlocked all three of that last door, whatever it is. Oh, all the doors are unlocking. It seems like these people can't even get through the small doors, which renders them kind of trapped here. Uh, plus left shift to echolocate nearby hive crevices. Oh, okay, I see something from down there. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, that is so brutal. Hi, dude. Hi. 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 Hi, little dude. Oh, do you uh, do you want to run? Do you want to run for it? You can. You can run for it. Nope. Nope. You just get eaten. And let's absorb this place and put my DNA out through everything. This is so cool. It's so cool. Oh my god, it's like a big mouth. Yeah, okay, I'm liking this. I am loving this. So, presumably at some point, these people have gotta, like, send stronger people after me, right? Can I fit through that pipe? No, I cannot. This appears to be a dead end. So, let's go up. Let's go up here. Here. Oh yeah, because the place, was it over here that opened up? Up here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, there we go. Squeeze in there. Okay. This is just so fun. It's... It's obviously it's not scary. I mean, it's kind of disturbing, but like in a really cool way. Okay. Seals breached 50, biomass samples lost 100%, containment unit locked status breached okay so we're doing good i think i don't know 
what all that means. Um, let's sleepy slide our way down here. Where am I supposed to go? Let's squeeze in there. Maybe this is a good place. I could really use a map of some sort. Ooh. Ooh, I did something. I did something. Oh my god, there's a helicopter taking off. Oh, I'm, I'm playing as a person now. That's, that's a little, little weird. Uh, cool, cool. Am I supposed to go this way? Wait a minute, I can't go through here. Oh, I'm descending the ladder, okay. The, the whole point was for me to play as the creature. Why am I playing as the person? Why, why I'm so sad all of a sudden, because I want to play as, as the creature. Guys, why am I not playing as the creature? A patch of antediluvian moss. Uh, antediluvian means it is from France, I believe. <laughs> so, okay, I can go up here. So why am I playing as some nameless scientist dude when I should be playing as a horrible monster who is eating the nameless scientist dude? Why, why, why this? A disorganized mass of bones and dry tissue. So I can only assume that this is just like a weird little aside thing to let me know what the scientists are doing. Unidentified species of tubifex worms. Very cool. What am I supposed to do? Oh, plant C4. Okay. Probably move back away from here. Probably. I assume you're going to blow that up now. Please. Oh, what is that weird cord that you have? Can I just like stand by here and get blown up? Come on. Blow me up. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, I have to do it, don't I? Of course I have to do it. Alright. So maybe the science lab was sealed off and this is the, like, the people going in and reopening it when they shouldn't and thereby... Yeah, okay, I'm back. I'm back, baby. This is the good stuff. This is what we want. This is what you want to see. This is what I want to see. Ooh, can I go... Okay. So... The thing, obviously, is, like the thing from the Thing movie, is has a lot of similarities to this, especially in terms of appearance, because the Thing is also a mass of bloody red tentacles, um, and that movie was so influential to me as a kid, because um, I remember watching it one Halloween, I must have been like, I don't know, four, 14, 13, but... I thought it was really cool, and I got to that scene in it, uh, one of the more infamous scenes, the blood test scene, where there's a bunch of people who may or may not be infected by the thing, and they test their blood with by dipping it in a, like a hot needle to see which one is really the thing. And eventually, of course, the thing, its blood reacts, the one that is actually the thing, and they're all tied up together on a bench, so when it reacts, it Oh, can I reach down here yet? No? No. Maybe if I adjust myself carefully? No, I cannot. Okay. But the uh, thing which is tied to these two people starts transforming, and people who are also on the bench are just freaking out, obviously. And it is just such a good scene. And when I was young and watched it for the first time, it just scared so much. It was terrifying. And I love that. I love the things that scared me as a kid. Because now I get to look back and think, wow, that was such a rush of emotions at the time. It really, like, cemented my love. Oh, what happened? Okay, I'm down here now. It really cemented my love for horror and for body horror because the thing is definitely body horror and this is pretty much the thing as a game and i'm i'm just 
jabbering on because I don't actually know what to go, I, where to go. I'm, at, I, I'm a little bit at a loss. Wait, oh, I'm a dumbass. Oh, I know what I can do. I keep forgetting about my web shooting thing. I could go... Oh, it is over here, isn't it? Back to... Is it up here? Yes, it is. Back to this place. No. Where is it? I'm dumb. I don't know where things are in video games. I don't have good spatial awareness. It's fine. Oh, that's that's that place. Uh, no, that was definitely not where I need to go. Uh, when I find the place, you'll know. You'll know because I'm gonna cut to there. I'm gonna cut to me finding it. So you can see that I'm smart and I do find things eventually. Oh god, it's not in there. Okay, so I'm probably being an absolute dumbass, but I cannot figure out how to progress. So I'm probably going to cut this first episode here, but I'm definitely going to make more than one episode because this game is so cool. So I'm having a blast and I hope that you're having fun watching it too. And by next episode, I will have figured out how to progress. This is something that I will do. I will master it. Um, so until next time, why don't you, why don't you go out and find some you know, find some eldritch abomination to call your own. Till then.